Well, you all know that we love sending our receptionist, Jeannie, around the country to help us surprise deserving people in need. Today, she's in Brooklyn, New York. Let's check in with her right now. Hey, hey, Jeannie. Hi, Ellie. How you doing? Hi. Well, can you tell me? How are you? I'm, I'm really good. Tell us who we're surprising today. Okay, Alan, I'm really, really excited about this one. The person that we're surprising today started an after-school program that has helped countless of students get free college education. He's constantly paying out of his own pocket to provide for this program. And, I mean, this guy, he postponed his own wedding because he wanted to make sure that his students got what they needed first. He's absolutely amazing. That's great. And what is his name, Jeannie? Oh, his name is Lanier Young. Oh, and he's here right now. Lanier, come here. So, didn't you think, well, that sounds like me. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, damn Brooklyn, I'm here. Uh, I started an after-school program. Yeah, I'm like. I postponed my wedding. I said, that sounds like my story. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, your name is Lanier, but you have a nickname, right? Yes, everybody call me Dinero. What, why do they call you Dinero? Um... Uh, just a name that I came up with and stuck with it, and everybody just either call me De Niro or Money. All right, De Niro or Money. Yes. Oh, well, <laughs> you can call me Sweetwater. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why. I just decided that that's my nickname. Just now. So tell us about the after-school program. This is really amazing, what I learned. Um, well, the after-school program, we started, well, I started it because at the age of three, I was adopted by my mother, and we started the program because a lot of people made fun of me and made me feel like I was abandoned at a young age, so I wanted to make sure that... I'm sorry. No, it's emotional. Uh, It's good. I wanted to make sure that no kid ever feels abandoned or feel like they don't have a family or a place to go. So at Drill Masters NYC, we make sure that everybody succeeds, everybody gets into school uh, for free, and that they're uh, outstanding, upstanding pillars of the community. <laughs> so, uh, and it's Drill, what, in Drill Masters, tell us about that. Um, in drill masters, we help kids um, on and off court. We teach student athletes, not athletic students. Books comes first. Uh, we help with homework. We make sure any issues that they have in school, we make sure we address them. Uh, you can't pick up a basketball if you're not doing good in school. So we make sure that every kid, we have a 90 to 95 percent uh, rate that the kids graduate and they're going to college for free. That's what I was going to ask you. That's amazing. And there's one young lady, Deja, I think her name is. Yes, Deja, uh, she came to us a couple of months ago, and she was having a rough time. She didn't have any uh, any school, so she came on down to Drill Master. She comes all the way from Connecticut, all the way to Brooklyn. And we've been in the gym three to four times a week, working hard, working hard. And over the summer, she has got uh, numerous offers to college, so she's going to school for free. Wow. So, uh, Jeannie is in Brooklyn. Do you want to see who she's with there? Yes. All right. Hey, Jeannie. Look who she's with. Oh! Look at her. Okay. <laughs> oh, wow. Too. All right, so listen, we, uh, the, the Brooklyn Nets uh, heard about this story. They have a little message for you. Let's watch. Hey, De Niro. It's Brooke Lopez from the Brooklyn Nets. We heard your story and think what you're doing for the Brooklyn community is incredible. You're an awesome role model, and as a thank you, we want to invite you and all the kids in the Drill Masters program to one of our home games and our special guests. See you soon. De Niro's special gift. They sent you this. Aww. Thank you. You're welcome. We'll be right back. You notice there's one person that was not in that shot with Jeannie. 
and that is because she's here. Deja, come on out. So, Deja, tell me why this guy, I mean, I think we all know, you can hear how amazing he is, and, oh. and especially the intention of where he was coming from, that he really cared about kids because of his own experience. But tell me about him from your perspective. Well, I joined Drill Masters um, early May, and I was at a point during basketball where I was just stagnant, and stagnant with myself. And uh, my parents sacrificed and found an arrow, and... Um, he did his job, and I busted my butt to get up there when I needed to, and I put in my work, and he gave me 200% back. Yeah. And that's that's how I got these offers and the other these other schools, and then it came to a point where I was like, I'm committing. <laughs> and I, I found the so school, excited. and I and I fell in love with the school, and I'm happy. And he really pushed me and showed another side of me that I, that I didn't see. That's amazing. <laughs> that's amazing. <laughs> we need more of this, right? More of this everywhere. Yeah. If, if every every school had a De Niro, that would make a huge difference in a lot of kids' lives. Right. Um, right. We want to uh, give you two a chance to raise some money for Drill Masters. Um, and I think you're, you're going to do a pretty good job. Let's walk over here. Oh. oh. All right. So each basket you make, we're going to give you $1,000 per basket. Okay? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. First, so... 30 seconds, so you just keep getting those balls and somebody will keep throwing them to you. Make sure we give them the balls back as soon as they bounce off, okay? 30 seconds on the clock. Go. For it. Go. helping communities and inspiring stories like yours. They want to round that number up and give Drill Masters $20,000.